Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to talk about IP addresses, which are the address that devices in a computer network use to communicate with each other. Um, it is uh, the abbreviation of uh, Internet Protocol Address, which makes sense because Internet is a huge network and devices in Internet need something like an uh, identifier to locate each other. And uh, this identifier is nothing but IP address. Um, IP address is nothing but a string of numbers uh, assigned to devices. These devices can be computers, servers, or routers, which I'm going to talk about in next videos. And pretty much everything connected to internet um, need an um, IP address to be able to communicate. And uh, it can also be used to pinpoint location of any device around the world. Um, we have two versions of IP address, including IP address version 4 and IP address version 6. So uh, most of the time when we talk about IP address, we mean IP version 4. IP version 6 is actually made um, as we are running out of IP address. And the transition from IPv4 to IPv6 is happening, but um, uh, I'm quite certain that IP version 4 is going to be around for a long time. Um, IPv4 is made up of four decimal numbers separated by dots. Each number is there for a reason, and um, some IP addresses have a specific purpose. But just to simplify, each part or each number can be a number between 0 and 255. Um, you may know that we can convert each decimal number to a binary combination. Binary is um, 0 or 1. And um, if, we can, if we convert uh, each decimal number to binary, uh, as I said, because uh, the number is going to be between 0 to 255. So there are going to be 8 binary part to each decimal. And that's why most of the time we call each part of the IP address as we refer them as um, octet. Because as you know, octet means combination of 8. and um, if all binary numbers per each decimal part of the IP address is zero, it means we are going to have decimal number of zero for that part of IP address. And then if we have one for all eight parts of a decimal number, the result will be 255. And that's why as I mentioned, each decimal number in IP address is a number between 0 and 255. We have different types of IP addresses, um, dynamic, static, public, private, and loopback IP addresses. Um, dynamic IP addresses are uh, assigned to devices automatically using a protocol called DHCP. Um, DHCP itself is abbreviation of Dynamic Host Configuration Protocol. Um, just a side note, in computer network worlds, everything is protocol, which is, um, to simplify, the protocol is just an application that does a particular job. Um, the IP addresses that are assigned by DHCP automatically are actually uh, least base and uh, changes from um, time to time, but uh, static IP addresses are another type of IP address which won't change once they're they uh, assign to a device. Um, so um, probably you are connected to internet using dynamic IP address, which uh, is assigned by your um, internet service provider and uh, once you re reboot your um, internet router or modem um, it is going to be uh, a different um, IP address 
And um, just a side note, uh, you can have a static IP address uh, for connecting to internet, uh, but you need to buy one IP from your uh, internet service provider. And um, it is useful for when you are providing a service on the internet, like maybe hosting a website, and people need to find you by your IP address. And um, that makes sense that that IP address uh, shouldn't uh, get changed. So that's why uh, you uh, need a, like a static IP address from your internet service provider. Um, another category of IP addresses or um, another way to categorize IP addresses are um, public IP addresses versus private IP addresses. So um, public, I public IP addresses are uh, the ones used to uh, connect you to internet world. But uh, you can have uh, private IP addresses which uh, you can use for setting up your network, but you cannot use the same IP address to connect to internet. Um, you can find your public IP address by actually going to Google and type what is my IP. And the IP that you're, you, you're going to see is your public IP address. So your device is able to connect to internet using that public IP address. Um, private IP address ranges are uh, the ones you can see on screen and um, everything that are not part of these range, ranges can uh, potentially connect you to internet but um, the important part is that um, it should be assigned by your internet service provider. Um, the last type that we're going to talk about are uh, loopback IP addresses. Uh, the loopback IP address uh, actually is referred as local host, host as well and it's used to establish connection to the same machine or computer that is being used by the end user. So it's actually pointing to the same computer or same host. And it is nothing but uh, 127.0.0.1. Uh, you may actually hear this um, often as well. And it is most often uh, used by applications on your own computer. Uh, and the kind of communication between different different parts of the application maybe or um, for uh, um, creating labs or uh, for um, some kind of tests, virtual tests with your machine. So this was an overview to um, IP addresses and uh, for more detailed information about networking and IP addresses as well, stay tuned. Um, please, if you like the video, um, hit the like button and also subscribe and see you in the next video. Bye!